Hi team, welcome back to Fit Life Champions in Denver, Colorado. My name is Dave Glazer. I want to walk you through uh, a few physio ball plank progressions um, that I love to use during all phases of our athletes' um, calendar year, uh, mesocycle, macrocycle, and microcycle. Um, taking a plank variation to a physio ball adds a little extra challenge, of course, because of the stability that's created in the shoulder and the core and the anterior hip of uh, your body. Um, of course, we're going to identify the easiest version, simply placed right there on our forearms and elbows directly below the shoulder. With a nice flat back, chin is, chin is tucked, and a neutral spine. Um, during our strength phase, we, we start with a high plank version. And I'm holding the ball as if my wrists can be straight the whole time. So I'm not on top of the ball. I'm on the side of the ball so that my wrists and elbows are directly below my shoulder joint um, so that I don't get uh, hyperextension of my wrist joint and I can actually challenge my athlete a little bit more. If I had a partner here and I'm in the high plank position and they're giving me a little bit of a shake with their hand or with their foot, then I can actually feel the core engage even more with that additional challenge to the stability. Uh, an additional version is a high plank with feet elevated, back flat, chin is tucked, and then uh, my partner can come by and give it a little kick underneath the feet so that my core has to stabilize even more. Not so much of a kick that it flies across the room like that, but it's just a little kick so that I have to restabilize my hips in an elevated position. So those are a few versions that we use during the strength endurance phase at Fit Life Champions. Again, my name is Dave Blazer. For the best online mentorship program available for personal trainers who want to build a business, master online training, and eventually open their studio, head on over to daveglazer.com. Thank you.